Nice. Wow, that was pretty good. That was actually first try. All right, you guys have seen Kaiser do the tiny flipper tab. And As seen on the microlith. Yeah, small knives. Yes. And it works. It works mm -hmm. great. It does. Good knives. See those videos. Okay. You've also yeah. seen Kaiser do big flipper tabs. Giant flipper tabs. And we missed that one. Well, I wasn't, I didn't do the timing. Yeah. Well, that's, that's <laughs> kind of key. <laughs> now, this is the Kaiser Dukes. We've got a four-year-old video on this. Yes. And probably multiple videos at this point. This is still one of my all-time favorite Kaisers. It just is. It's a giant flipper tab, uh -huh. but guys, it works so nicely. It does. It's fun to flip. Uh-huh. All right. Okay. Well, how about, and that's kind of a medium-sized knife. Maybe right, a little, yeah, yeah, true. A little smaller. Uh-huh. How about some of their latest releases on Blade HQ? A couple of them. We've got the Noble right here. And the Zen, which is this one. Yeah, premium Kaisers, uh -huh. kind of full-size knives. Tiny flipper tabs. Let's show that one. These, yeah, these flipper tabs aren't much. No. Do they work? Look, they even printed S35 on yeah, the tab. Yeah, I noticed that too on that one. It's not on this not one. Not on this one, yeah. okay. Anything else on that side? Yeah. Yeah, it is S35VN, okay, American Steel. Do they work? They work really well. Yeah, I was sitting trying to make this one not work. And I couldn't. Really? I could do it a, li a little bit on this one because my finger slipped off of it. That's the only difference. Because of the way this is shaped, it kind of likes a push button. It's always a bit of a mix between light switch and push button, yeah. but it's how much of each. I was close to cutting you. Yeah. Let's, let's trade Tradesies. here. Yeah, this is the Zen. Yeah, that's the only thing about this one is that, yeah, I kind of need to... Oops. See? Oh! Our that's, tips touched. Did they? Yeah. No. I think so. That's more of a traditional shaped flipper tab. It's just small. Yeah. Okay, this one I'm going to say, if you have large hands, maybe... I'm sorry. I moved, moved our, it. I moved our whole foundation. I know. If you have big hands, maybe not. It works. It, it does work. Let's check out the sizes of these two. Well, actually, okay. first, we should get out of the way. These are brand new releases. Yes. I said premium already. The Zen priced at one fifty nine, and this is the Noble at one sixty five. So about the same price. Yeah. There's only one variety in uh -huh. each right now. There they are. As you guys can tell, it's gray titanium. Yeah, S S thirty five VN on both. Uh, pretty much three and a half inch blades on each. Uh -huh. uh, where was I going with that, Frankie? Well, the Noble is probably more if you have large to extra large hands. Yeah. But then you're going to have that baby flipper tab, so... But it works. Yeah. It works. For little... me, this one fits really nicely. Yeah. Even though it is three and a half inches, so it is a little bit bigger than my normal size knives. Otherwise, I'm going to use a word on that knife. A tweener? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Svelte. It is very svelte. Yeah. Well, okay, since, since well, we're talking look, about it. Well, look, it kind of has, it's, it's, it's a trailing point, too, but you can just see that smoothness going. Whoosh. Yeah. I was going to say it's Sinkovich-esque. That's a word. Mm, yeah, I would say it is. But with the trailing point, it's not It's not like a copy or no, anything. No, it's, it's not. Just, it's it's um, that of a Sinkovich style. Yes. See, it's just a little small for me, this one. See, and I it's opposite for me. It's like this one is more... This one's easier for me to, to do flip? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. than that one. All right. So it just depends on your hands or preference. Both very nicely done on the detent. Yeah. Nice quality. So this is titanium. They did a milled kind of pattern on this one, which I think looks cool. Yes. I like it when it's holy. Holy. Uh -huh. Both sides. Gives you some grip. Even the pocket clip is holy. That's kind of neat, too. A little accent to it. Let's show that. Don't remove the pocket clip because there's no reason to. Never mind. Wait a second, that one you can swap. I was thinking of the Zen. Yeah. You can completely change it. Okay, our mistake. You can. Lefties need apply on this one. Do lefties buy right hand frame locks? Let us know. Lettuce. Lettuce sounds good. Let us know. That's that's a weird thing to crave. <laughs> yeah. I always have. It's the weirdest thing. Backspacer with a built in lanyard hole. I like it. It's very smooth. No hot spots on this knife. Mm -hmm. Carries very well. Yeah. It is a kind of an understated tanto. Stonewash finish on that flat grind. Actually, you want to give us a couple of stats here? Okay, I can give some stats. Some stats, yeah. Yeah. Not cheap. 
So, you know, you gotta see if like you're getting you, your money's worth. You're not cheap. Get the thickest point there, Frankie. I'm going to the thickest point? Jeez, I'm not going in the indentation. Point four not Really? I would have thought that this was a little bit thicker. Point four nine on the noble, so but exactly look at this. average. Look at how thin this knife is. Like, I'm going down that much. Point four zero. That's what's nice is that it's so thin. Point four, four zero seven. Call it point four one. Yes, it is thin. And it is not very tall. Narrow? Yeah. We still never come up with a word for right. that one. Uh -huh. The yeah. height. The height of the knife. Okay. Point one three is the blade thickness. On the noble. That's On exactly. The noble. I'm going to call that average. Slices very nicely. This one's thinner. I can feel just because I went down a little bit. Point one two. Point one two, so even slightly on the thin side, probably still pretty average. Yeah. Flat grind on both, I mentioned that. Uh, very piercy, stabby knife on this. Uh huh. Which is what you look for in a knife. It's really a nice user, maybe just a little small for extra large hands, and then take into account that flipper tab. Yeah. Go well, ahead. and I wish that there was a little bit, I wish there was color to it also. So maybe if the, these are sellers they will change it a little bit that's what i wonder what happens on I these they they just did the one variety kaiser just released a bunch of models yeah on blade hq and, and um i think they just you know see which ones sell and then and then go from there how much do you think they weigh um average i'm gonna say actually they're both a little light less than three ounces the zen is pretty light go ahead i think but this is the question which one weighs more? Dang, they're close. Right? They're like well, very similar. Which that is interesting too, because this knife holes. is bigger. But yeah, it's got the speed holes. Go ahead, less than three. 2.66, that's awesome. I kind of almost want to say that this one is less. Yeah, no, it's not, no. 2.7 is my guess. 2.9, okay. Okay. But it is very light for what it is. Yeah, that's crazy yeah. though. All right, what are you guys thinking? Kaiser, out of China, nice production company out of China using American blade steel. A little bit of a choil on this that's kind of useless. Yeah. Can't touch the blade at the back. Yeah, like I said, no hot spots. This one's very, yes. You know what this one reminds me of too? Hmm. Some kind of a fish. Yes. Yeah. A minnow. <laughs> All right, regular size knives. Tiny flipper tabs. We brought out a few examples. See, there was me. Like, yeah, he would need to... It's a it's a different yeah. technique on that it one. It is, yeah, it is. I love carrying and using this one. Okay, you brought out more... Oh. Non-Kaisers, anyway. Right. Yeah. Here's my... Uh, Frankie. I always forget the name of this knife. Zinker. It's the Zinker something. It's one of Zinker's knives. Oh my gosh, why yeah. do we always... I'll, I'll, Earth, I would have, I would have Earth, annotated no. it. Oh my no. gosh, okay. Let's and not then and the dog out. tooth, too. The dog tooth, that's one variety. Let's show the flipper tabs on these. Yeah, they're little. Dog tooth is kind of a smaller knife. Small flipper tab. Works really well. Yep. See that video? It's T something. T on this something? One. Yeah. For Tanto. Urban Trapper? Urban Trapper is the Boker version. Oh, yeah. But anyway. But it's like the trapper, like the actual trapper version. Pretty good size knife. Fairly small flipper tab. Uh -huh. Works great. Yeah. What else did I get out? You got out big flipper tabs. Well, there's the kendo. I guess it's kind of taller, but it's pretty minimal. Oh, I felt like my face was like right there. It wasn't. Swings out. Yeah. Yeah, large flipper tab. I mean, there's an example. There's the Nido Evo Typhoon. Awesome knife. Yeah. Awesome action. It's hydraulic. But yeah, giant Which one tab. sticks out more? Kaiser Dukes? Probably, huh? Do you have anything else over there? No, I took them all out. I, okay. Oh, these guys. So here's the Splinter Premium and Vanguard from Kaiser. These are closer to a full-size knife with a, yeah. with a small tab. See, I slipped off first try. It's kind of like the same profile, though. Like, look at that. Yeah. I feel they're, like those. They're a little smaller. Yeah, a little smaller. A touch smaller. I don't know. I'm what do you guys think? Now. I just am curious if... Who has the bigger flipper tab? Flipper tab. We were all listening in. Between which ones? I, I missed the first one. The brain nature. Oh, probably the Dukes. Okay, so I'm measuring it from the base of the shaft to right. the... It is right at 0.3. Okay. 
Okay, I'm saying the Dukes. No, Brian's really? bigger. <laughs> Hopefully he's watching. Point three four. Yep. And it's awesome. And I just say it. I just measured. I had to see. He's got his initials there too. Mhm. Mm Love it. I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with big flipper tabs for me. I don't mind me. them either. I don't care. Yeah. Um, sometimes they can get annoying in your pocket as you're carrying them, I suppose. But tiny flipper tabs are cool, especially when they work well. Yeah. Sometimes too small is too small. Yeah. yeah. Correct. Yeah. All right. We'll put links into Kaiser where you can get them. Thanks for using those. Request one of Frankie's drawings. Uh, I shouldn't say that. I should send more, too. Yeah, we need to send more. I need to not everybody, crank some out. Not everybody gets one. No. All right. We do appreciate the support, though. Thanks yes. a lot for joining us. Bye.